More than six months, Sarah Ingram grieved the loss of her high school sweetheart, Isaac Rodriguez. He was murdered outside his South Richmond trailer home back in August. Sarah was nearby when the fatal shots were fired. Her father tells me the two will be close again, buried near each other in a Chesterfield cemetery after a weekend fatal car crash. Just a few hundred yards from his front door. They pulled out and that was about 845 in the morning. Said she'd be back in a little while, and that was the last time I saw my baby. Saturday morning, a crash claims the life of Jason Ingram's little girl. You talk about two tragedies since, since Isaac's passing. She's had a lot of trouble. You know, she's gotten a DUI. She had dabbled in substance abuse. She was doing her best to clean back up. But when I, when I recognized the car, the first thing I thought of was, oh, God, my baby's done been arrested, at, you know, first thing in the morning. And, and he come back down and told me my baby was dead. The 19-year-old wasn't wearing a seatbelt when the car she was riding in ran off Beulah Road and hit a tree. The driver, 22-year-old friend, now charged with DUI manslaughter. Jason Ingram actually drove by the scene moments after the crash and spoke to police where he learned his daughter had been killed. He says he is certain she'd be alive today if she would have buckled up. Instead, he's planning her funeral while vowing to continue his daughter's most important cause. Justice for Isaac. She had handed him cookout. They had went to get cookout. She handed him that, went, leaned back in the car to get something else when the gunshots rang out, and she dropped her stuff and ran and uh, didn't know he had been hit until after she came back out and the police were there. That was August 9th at Tom Ford's trailer park on Richmond Highway. Ingram, Dad says, struggled and had not been right since. Sometimes she would open up and sometimes she didn't want to talk about it at all. But... All she ever wanted from that day forth, if you find any of her social media, it was all the hashtag justice for Isaac. That's all she wanted. Justice they will hopefully feel together. Rodriguez's father reaching out to Ingram after learning of Sarah's death and offering her a spot in Sunset Cemetery close to Isaac with hopes the two will rest in peace near each other for eternity. I know he was up there waiting on her and uh, I told him today when it's a cemetery, I said, you better take good care of my baby before I get there. And I know he will. Rodriguez's father has also volunteered to be a pallbearer. The girl's viewing will be Sunday. Her funeral will be on Monday. Her father tells me she will be buried in her prom dress from Meadowbrook High School, something she never got to wear because of COVID.